we didn't have any chance to discuss uh, anything like this with President Trump, Trump or with anybody else in the United States. We didn't have a chance to discuss anything with the Americans because the current administration uh, is not interested in uh, having any dialogue except from time to time on issues of the uh, detainees, exchanges, uh, functioning of the two embassies in Washington and in Moscow, and the mission in New York. Uh, but not on any uh, policy matters. Anybody who is sincerely interested in justice, uh, including justice being established in the relations between Russia and Ukraine, uh, which would involve, of course, stop, uh, stopping the Western policy of using Ukraine as an instrument of war against Russia, we would be ready to listen. President Putin repeatedly said that it is not true when somebody is saying that Russia is against negotiations. Actually, uh, Anthony Blinken said this in Davos uh, a few days ago. It is not true. Russia was always emphasizing that any serious proposal which would include the discussion of the situation on the ground, of the origin of this situation, and of reaching a solution which would guarantee legitimate national interests of Russia and Ukrainian people, we would be ready to discuss it. The goal is very simple. We have been uh, warning publicly for the last, well, since 2008, 2007 even maybe, uh, that NATO expansion uh, against all the promises given to Yeltsin and to Gorbachev uh, not to expand the alliance, NATO expansion was going too far. Five waves of expansion and then NATO uh, last, I mean at the last moment in, at the end of 2021 uh, found itself just on the borders of the Russian Federation. Much of the West believes that this is a violation, both 2014 uh, and the, this intervention, is uh, a violation of Ukrainian the West, sovereignty. The West, the West uh, has discredited itself completely and frankly... Why is this Western when over 140 countries in the General Assembly voted to condemn this invasion. It is not important for us who was voting what way, uh, because uh, all these votes, I know how the uh, Americans and the Brits and some Europeans uh, are getting those votes. I have many friends in, in New York and when these resolutions were voted, I asked why did they vote this way? And they told me, you know, being a bit ashamed, you understand that I have worked here for 10 years. Uh, my kids are in Stanford, and before the vote, uh, they came to me and said, don't forget about that your kids are studying the, uh, and don't forget that your bank account is in such and such bank. So your, Wait your a second. contention you, is that no, 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 my, all, my, most my, of these countries no, no, no. were pressured by the United States? Not most, all of them.